Hey Libras and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your daily love reading for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Libra signs. So let's see what you have going on in love today. What do you need to know? What's your current situation? Alright, your current situation is the temperance card. Trying to find balance. Trying to find that inner peace. Your next card out is the bat or the page of pentacles. What's blocking you from moving forward here? I feel a block. We're gonna see what that is. What's blocking our Libras from this offer? Well, maybe there isn't one. Yep, there is one. All right, the Six of Swords. So this is the front side of the Six of Swords where they're taking off from that, you know, those rough waters, that difficult situation. This is arriving at that place of inner peace, that Paradise Island, that place um, that you sought out to reach. You're arriving there. Spirit's advice for you is the Five of Pentacles and the outcome is the Two well, the two of Pentacles in reverse. This is the front side. That is the back side. Your, block, or your bottom of the deck and what you don't know is the Devil. It's clarified with the Four of Swords. This is the back side of the four that's the front and the back side of the king of swords that's the front that's the back so libras so you guys most definitely could right now you're just trying to heal you're trying to find that inner peace trying to find balance again after <clears throat> an ending to a relationship of the past you're trying to get to a place of feeling like normal again um patience is needed during this process you are moving into a place where you will receive an offer or you will be giving an offer something tangible something you know real that you can hold on to um what's blocking you is moving away from the past releasing that you know those those swords, that heartache, those um, different situations, those different relationships that all left a little bit of a scar. Um, you're wanting to heal that inner, that inner being, that inner spirit, that inner child, and that's what you are working on. Um, but the the block for you is truly releasing the that energy, truly releasing that heartache of the past. Spirit's advice for you is to find that inner light. This is the front side of the five of pentacles, that suffering, that, you know, cold, dark energy. This is coming inside the church and finding that inner light, finding that you can heal from any situation, no matter what, financial, emotional, spiritual, whatever have you. Your outcome is a beautiful um, balance that you are achieving. You're learning to balance your life out. Um, doing so well that even people are coming out to, you know, watch you doing that, that dance of change, um, turning your back on vicious cycles. What you don't know is the devil. So this is a cycle that you are in and you are going to successfully release that cycle and get out of that toxic, you know, because doing the same thing, um, you know, year after year with, you know, being with somebody, then they leave or you leave and then going back and then doing it all over again. It's all part of karmic cycles that you are going through. You are recognizing that and you are going to be able to release it. So let's see why temperance is here. Yeah, you're needing to heal from the past, from this broken heart, from somebody who truly 
truly broke you. Could be a Sagittarius here. Um, we got Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. That's about all I'm seeing. But you're really trying to heal that past. Heal the inner child. Heal that, that heart um, that has been broken by somebody who you trusted. Um, why is the Page of Pentacles here in the near future? The Hierophant. Yeah, so you are going to get an offer of a stable you know, commitment. You are going to get a relationship that you have been hoping for. Um, it's just the only thing blocking you is that release and that healing that you must do, Libras. Why is the Six of Swords here as their block? The King of Pentacles. So yeah, an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could have most definitely um, Capricorn heavy here. Have broken your heart, left you um, in this place of, you know, they could have ghosted you, could have walked away from you, no communication. And now you're just kind of forced to move forward um, on your own, healing your own, um, healing your heart so you can move forward. But it is going to bring you into a very stable spiritual connection as well as a um, an offer from somebody who wants a true commitment. Why is the five of pentacles here as their advice? The six of swords, yeah. To heal that inner to heal the inner child, the advice for you is you must go within. You have to find that inner light. You have the power to heal. That inner child, as long as you listen to your intuition, you follow that inner guide, it will lead you to the warmth of the church. It will bring you out of this cold, dark place that you've been in, experiencing all these this pain, all these swords. So Spirit's advice for you is to, um, to have faith, most importantly, that you can heal from this. You can move forward, but you can't stay in that same spot. You have to move forward. You have to... Um, allow change to happen. The Two of Pentacles is all about uh, changing the cycles. Um, and when you do that, you will get the opportunity for a new beginning. Um, and it will give you the opportunity as well, Libra, to come in and speak your truth. To uh, For some of you, you didn't get closure when they walked away. And you feel like you need that closure to heal. However, you may not get that from them. You have to offer your own closure. You have to heal on your own. Um, and when you begin to move forward and move on, they will return and you will get your opportunity to deliver um, the truth of, of what this truly did to you. And it will then um, open that door for a new opportunity. Um, most definitely. Why is the devil here? Is there what's unknown to them. So you you possibly don't know that this is a karmic cycle you're in, but you can complete this. This is done and over. You can stop this. And I do feel you will. You are going to break out of this cycle. You are going to break free from that um, and complete this and close the door to this person and this karmic cycle. You're, you need to heal that those three of swords. Um, it may, the world may be crashing and burning all around you, but you need to shut yourself away from the world so you can heal. So you can take the truth that you have learned that caused this three of swords, heal that mind, body, and soul. And when you come out of that time of rest, you can grab that ace of swords and move forward with that truth. Um, this is all hitting you like a bolt of lightning out of the blue. Um, you're realizing this is you. This is your story. It needs to stop. You can't be in these cycles anymore. Um, Wow. Here's Here you are retreating. It's time to go within. It's time to allow that rest. To heal and to find that inner light that's in that lantern. That is the star we have it in us at all times. Which was the next car at the card at the bottom of your deck. Um, but like a bolt of lightning out of the blue, you're going to realize it's time for you to step into your own path. It's time for you to, no matter how hard it may be, to go in the direction that you feel you're meant to go. The, your inner guide will lead you there. It will lead you to a place of warmth, of happiness. Once you complete this cycle with this person that you have been in cycle after cycle with, um, and it's then turned toxic, 
And once you do that, you will be able to then step into your power, then create the world and the life that you're hoping for, where your prayers have been answered and your wishes will come true. But you have to end the cycle, end the toxicity, um, and heal that inner child. And when you get out of that place of that mental place of being mentally stuck where you're at right now, where this healing is needed, um, that is when you will have somebody come in for you, um, Libras, who truly has your best intentions at heart and can truly move into the future with you and offer you this stable, um, real commitment where, um, where it will be a balanced give and take. But be patient with yourself. It's not easy to heal the inner child. It's not easy to heal the, the hurts that you have just experienced. But when you um, come out of that and break this cycle, it will change the whole world, your whole world. Um, you got the fire prince as your, uh, your advice. And this is just being optimistic. Nothing is out of reach. Nothing is too difficult. Nothing is too broken to fix. You have to believe you can do it. Um, so remain optimistic and go after what you want. Don't stand by waiting for, for this person to return. Go after, um, you know, find that, that time to heal and then go after what you truly, truly deserve. The angels are helping you. They're helping you heal, but you have to believe it. You have to be optimistic about what's coming in for you and that you can get through this um, because there is a very spiritual connection, a very stable uh, commitment that is coming in for you. It's going to bring you a lot of passion and new beginnings. So right now it's just time to rest, to find that inner light, to heal from the three of swords and know that. You don't have to go through this cycle again. You have the power at any time to break free from this back and forth, juggling in and out, constant cycle that you have been in. So move forward and move into the light Libras and you will, um, you will see the change in your emotions, your spiritual connection. Um, everything's about to change for the better for you. So. All right, Libras, I hope you have a beautiful day. God bless.